JPG or HEIF, which photo format should you actually use? One is old but widely supported. The other is new, more efficient but might cause compatibility issues. If you've ever been confused by these two file types, especially on your iPhone or while editing photos, you're not alone. In this video, we're breaking down the real differences between JPG and HEIF in a clear, simple way. Stick around to the end. I'll also show you which one to use, depending on your device, your goals, and your workflow. Let's dive in. What is JPG? First up, short for Joint Photographic Experts Group. This format has been around since the 1990s and is the most widely used image format on the planet. JPG is known for good compression, decent quality, compatibility with almost every device, app and website. But it uses lossy compression, which means some image quality is sacrificed to reduce file size. Section 2. What is HEIF? Now let's talk about the newer kid on the block, HEIF short for High Efficiency Image Format. HEIF is designed to replace JPG with better compression and higher image quality at smaller file sizes. It's the default format for most iPhones since iOS 11 and is also used in formats like EIC, a version of HEIF. Advantages of HEIF include 50% smaller file size than JPG, better detail and color depth, support for advanced features like live photos, transparency and animations. But here's the catch. Not all devices and apps support it yet. Section 3. JPG versus HIF. The real differences. So, JPG is still king in terms of compatibility, but HIF is clearly the future of mobile photography. Which one should you use? It depends on your priorities. Choose JPG if you need maximum compatibility, older software, websites or sharing with non-tech users. You're working with photo editing tools that don't fully support HIF. You're archiving images across multiple platforms. Choose HEIF if you use an iPhone and want the best quality with smaller file sizes. You care about storage efficiency. You're using modern editing tools like Apple Photos, Lightroom or Capture One that support HEIF. Pro tip. On iPhone, you can go to Settings, Camera, Formats and switch between High Efficiency, HEIF and Most Compatible, JPG, depending on your needs. At the end of the day, both formats have their place. If you're working across multiple devices or sharing images frequently, JPG is still reliable. But if you want to save storage and capture more detail, HEIF is the modern choice, especially for iPhone photographers. Which one do you use more, JPG or HEIF? Let me know in the comments. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell icon for more content like this. Thanks for watching and keep capturing.